We're here with Kyler Hyatt of Iguana Boat Sales, and we're atop a rinker. Kyler, there's a lot of leg room in this boat. Uh, yeah, uh, rinker uh, just brought back in uh, a longtime employee, Kim Slocum, um, and he did a great job coming in and uh, really redesigning and uh, putting some new lines and some new interior in these boats and making them look awesome. So let's talk about, this is considered an open bow, but when I look at it, it's wide open all the way around. Who's the customer that, that would be interested in this? Uh, open bows are great day boats. Uh, it's kind of that customer that wants that speed of that, out, that inboard outboard motor and also wants that luxury and that room that a, a pontoon would provide. You know, it's a great point because there's a lot of people who really do, they, they want the family to be on the boat. They want to stay on the water a lot of the day. They want to participate in a lot of different water sports, but they don't necessarily want to go with a pontoon or a tritune yet. So this does look like a great, a great step in that direction. Oh yeah, the way they design these boats, they make them great for a lot of people, great for big families. Uh, you can see on this one, it's got the nice uh, tall arch with a, a tow hook up to it. So you can pull a wakeboarder. Uh, makes a huge difference pulling from the the arch compared to the back of the boat and as well as this the open room for uh, just cruising down the water. Absolutely and of course we're here in the rear facing seat and there's a swim platform people make makes it easy for people to get on and off the boat out of the water. Oh uh, yeah they Enrique did a great job with this integrated transom uh, it's got a great place to entertain lay out here on a sun pad as well as just the side through uh, walks so you don't have to walk all over the uh, the seating it really helps keep the boat clean and also provides a great area for just uh, coving out. And a lot of advances have been made in the marine industry in the last few years and a very vital part of boating, which is docking. So how, how's that control on this boat? Uh, the control on these boats are great. A uh, 26 foot boat um, is gonna be kind of your standard controls is what you're gonna see on most of them. Um, docking this thing's and not too hard of a job at all. <laughs> Piece of cake, right? Yeah, that's right. So what else is going on at Iguana that you guys offer so much? Iguana has grown so much since its inception. There's always something new happening there. Uh, yeah, I would say Denny, the owner, uh, I mean, he invests in the lake more than anybody else um, that I can think of. Uh, they're always building, they're always expanding. Uh, we just got our new uh, administration office put in right there on Osage Beach Parkway, right next to our sales office. Uh, Rip Rap and Dock are doing big things. Our rental continues to grow. And, and then among other things, he's just kind of helping build that, uh, that strip back up. We saw the Indian go up yeah, over right. the summer. So uh, they're doing a lot of things and uh, their expectations are continue to grow and continue to expand and make the lake a uh, destination. Yeah, Iguana has become a real partner to the lake community, not just the boating industry, but to the lake community itself. Oh yeah, I would say, Den like I said, Denny does so much for the community. Uh, he's so invested and um, he just, you can just tell that he loves the lake and he's trying to instill that in all his employees. And uh, we're just trying to help the community grow and become a pretty big part of it. Well, if folks didn't see you here at the Overland Park Boat Show, they can see you at some other boat shows coming up here through right before the season starts. Uh, yeah, we uh, currently at the St. Louis Boat Show as well. Uh, we'll be in the uh, St. Charles Show coming up, and uh, a few of us will head, even head down to Miami. <laughs> the few lucky ones are going to Miami. But then also you'll come back to the Lake of the Ozarks and be on the water here before we know it as well. Yeah, the summertime's coming up. Uh, our shops open up and we're ready for business. We've kind of had the slow period and it's gotten over with and we're we're excited and ready for people to start coming in the doors. Absolutely. So how can folks get a hold of you before they come to the lake or once they get there? What's the best way to find Iguana? Uh, the best way to find Iguana, we're right there on Osage Beach Parkway, uh, 4363. And uh, also just check out the website, iguanaboatsales.com. You can find all the contact information there. Well, thanks so much for chatting with us today. We look forward to seeing you on the water. And I mean, we really do look forward to seeing you guys on the water. <laughs> <Thank you. laughs>